Y'all want to know how much money I spent in Sephora for no damn reason? Then stay tuned. Okay, guys. So in the month of November, it seemed like Sephora had a sale every single week, and I was there for it. Okay, I work there, but I work on a Tuesday, come back on a Friday, and next thing you know, there's another sale, and there's more items, meaning that I am obliged to buy them. I didn't buy just for myself; I did buy for others too. Um, so that being said, let me show you guys what I did get because I'm ready to use them, but I haven't used them because I haven't showed y'all. Okay, so. I did get some Sephora brushes. Uh, we have the number 92. I still have them in the package, as y'all can see. These brushes were on clearance. The number 92 brush was $36. I didn't pay $36 for it. I think they were like $15. I'm going to put exactly what each item was down below because I'll go nuts trying to remember everything and how much I paid for them. Then I have two uh, crease brushes, the number 38s. And then I had another um, brush. Uh, excuse me fan brush number 65 these were all on clearance a lot of times we do have brushes that are on clearance and when they are clearance it's your best bet to go ahead and pick them up um, I love a nice brown lip liner and for some reason I thought that this um, no wonder I grabbed the wrong one okay so there is a um, a brown that is called hot sauce this whole time I've been using the wrong one. It is called uh, Hook Hook on Wood, and I want to show y'all what it looked like. And the reason why I got it was I thought it was a nice brown. Well, it's it's a nice mauve. It ha it, it reminds me of the uh, Lolita from Kat Von D, kind of, but that's not the brown I was looking for. So I got that. Which it goes good with my, with my nudes. But I was really looking for this, molasses. And it's always out of stock in the store. So that is molasses. And these are really reasonable. I'll put the price down below. Got that. Sephora has some really cute holiday lashes. So I got these tinsel lashes. And one has silver around the end of each of them. I think I will wear them for like, you know, the holidays. And this one has gold at the end. See how cute they are? Yes. I got the Sephora favorites. I love this package. I think I got this on sale as well. The retail price does say $68. I don't believe I paid $68 for it. Anywho, they give you several full sizes. One, two, three, four, five full sizes. So say for instance, you want to buy some lipsticks for somebody that you don't know what they would really want to wear. That way you can go ahead and give them this and they can have a variety of things to try and they have full sizes as well. So I thought that was really good. We have the Sephora Pro Artist Picks. This is a really good deal. I really believe it's a good deal for this alone and that's the Cartelet. Let me show you what it looked like. I love the Cartelet. It has this nice wonderful spray and I use it a lot for my clients. It has like a fresh just a spa like um, fragrance. And then they have um, a lippy. We have a moisturizer. We have the Murad which is skincare. So this whole set is just bomb. And it's super cheap. Uh, it says $30. This is a four favorite. The Superstars. So the Superstars, the retail price says $75. Um, and it has the hangover spray, which is a priming spray. This alone, the Charlotte Tilbury, the magic, uh, cream, that's what I really wanted. And I've, you know, tried samples and stuff in the store or whatever, but I was like, I really just want to have my own. And then they have a whole full size of the, um, Brow Wiz, the whole full size, and a whole full size of the Urban Decay liner, uh, which is black. I'm pretty sure this is Perversion. Yeah, it's Perversion. They have the Fenty primer in here as well, Smashbox Primer, a Kat Von D lipstick, Dior Shore Mascara, that is the a bomb mascara, Stila, is that the lippy, let me see what it is, Stila, oh no, it's a glitter and glow liquid eyeshadow, and Kit Karma, so I have several of these, most likely I'll be giving that away um, to somebody, and then we have the Laura Mercier, um, translucent powder which I am getting low in so this was perfect so you can you know gift this to yourself gift this to others um, pick some for yourself pick some for others you know so this is a really great deal you looking still to figure out what you need to buy for people then you know that's like 
a really, really good deal. Another thing that Sephora has really great deals is on perfumes and colognes. So this is a set where you can go ahead and just buy a whole trial size of a set. And with the men, you get a little nice baggie, a travel bag, which I thought was really nice. What they'll do is they'll be able to use any of the uh, trial size inside of the bag. And there's a certificate in there. And what it is is whenever they try something in the bag and they say, oh, okay, I really like this one, they can use that certificate and go back to Sephora and get a big size of whichever one of these that's included. And it tells you which size on the back that you can get of that. This alone is says $65. A lot of times you're able to get a lot of like Giorgio Armani. You're able to get like a 70 bucks, a Givenchy, Burberry. I mean, these are really good brands. Versace, that Dylan Blue smells bomb. Ladies, Dylan Blue for your boo? Yes. Even I have the uh, Versace as well for myself. I'm getting ready to show you that. <laughs> because... The women have a set too. Yes, yes we do. So this is retail's price at $75. And you see that we have the Dylan Blue in here. We have the Tory Burch. We have the Dolce, uh, Elizabeth uh, James Nirva, 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 Novana, whatever. Um, Kat Von D Center, Tom Ford, Black Orchid. Did y'all know the Black Orchid is like for men and women? Because I've had lots of clients that want to use it that are women and some that are men. My husband has it. I bought him the full size of it. But women come in for it all the time. And then we have the Victor and Roth Flower Bomb. So I had this and I bought this for myself knowing dang I'm well that I wanted this Versace. So bought that. And then I went into the store, used my certificate, and got me my full size. You see how that worked? So now I have my full size, even though this one is little, but it's Versace, and look how cute it is. This smell, y'all have to go in there. You know y'all can get samples from Sephora, right? Oh my God. It just smelled like heaven, so I'm like, it's, it's barely, I use it sparingly. <laughs> I use it sparingly, but I keep it like on my little perfume uh, area over there and I just spray it here and there because I love it to death and I don't want to use it all up okay I have bought this pop Stella McCartney it is it smells like it's like like uh, between like sweet and grown at the same time if that makes any freaking sense so it gives you a roller ball and also it gives you like a little small fragrance at the bottom as well which you could just open it up and you know dab it which is a little annoying but if you dab it dab it you know do this do this use the rollerball then you'll, you'll be all right <laughs> my husband has him a, a, a fragrance fetish and so I have bought him this Dolce & Gabbana light blue and he is in love with this stuff he has been getting spoiled in November because uh, we had an extra 10% off at Sephora. And I was like, well, if we're going to get fragrances, we might as well get them now. This stuff smells, oh, this smells so nice. It's fresh, ladies, for your men. And it's the light blue one, Dolce & Gabbana, light blue. I told y'all that my husband been getting spoiled with the um, cologne. So we have the John Barbatos. Smells so good. I think there's a uh, a white bottle, brown bottle, and a black bottle. This is the black bottle. Isn't it cute? Look at that. And uh, he barely put a dent in this. But this, ladies, y'all need to go in there and smell this. It smells so good. Oh, you be like, my man smell good. But you don't want him to smell good for nobody else, just you. <laughs> Wait, where on y'all date night? Mm -hmm. Not for work. No, not for work. Uh -huh. I'm going to show you guys some things that I got from skincare and like um, lips because, you know, think about it right now. Your lips are like really dry and chapped and just all nasty. I got the Laneige Lip Sleeping Mask. I already opened it because I already had to use the ladies. I'm sorry. My lips is all nasty. And it has this little like white little spoolie that you can use so you won't um, infect it. I mean, it's only your finger unless you're going to use it on clients then, you know. So I barely put a dent in it. It smells so good. It's like kind of like a fresh pink bubble gum. 
you know, that's really what it is, but it's very, it's very, very good, and I love it. It's bomb. I don't know if you guys know that Too Faced has some um, things for the lip department as well. They have the uh, peach lip scrub, and then they have the peach lip balm. These two together, I'm telling you, these two together, the scrub has like little bitty crystals in it, and the crystals, when you put it on, you just keep, keep you know, doing this. And then it just melts on your lips. So I use this at night. And then what I'll do is, after I do all this and try not to lick it off, because it do taste like peaches. Not that I'm not hungry. And then I would go ahead and put on the balm. So putting on the balm after the scrub, and then just go to sleep, you wake up, your lips just feel so nice. So nice. So yeah, don't forget to not neglect your lips, ladies. We really need, and men, and men, okay? Speaking of men, I bought my husband this Kiehl's Facial Fuel. I didn't know much about it, but I knew that it was a gel cleanser for men. I'm pretty sure we can use it as well, but it's not a lot of things that we have at Sephora that are just for men. And I wanted my husband to be able to start using something else for his face. And it has five-star reviews on the Sephora site, so I was like, it must be good. So um, he's going to start using this as well. Have you guys ever tried the fresh um, bath products? This one is the bath and shower gel. It's the sugar lemon. It's with sugar and mango seed oil. Okay, looks like that. It smells so good. So what I do is, oh, mm, wish I had smell vision. Um, <laughs> it just smells very, it smells lemony, but like a fresh lemon, if that makes sense. What I do is I put it in my tub, put it in the bath and let it bubble up and I also use it as a shower gel so um, people I don't understand why people say bath and shower gel it's just wash up gel right same thing but yeah smells so good they have other uh, fragrances they also have like these sugar cubes that you put in not sure these sugar cubes but, but they look like sugar cubes don't eat them you just pop them in the tub and they just you know it's like fragrance all in oh it just smells so nice so yeah fresh has really good bath stuff oh, hopefully i'm not boring you guys to death but this is where this is where the good stuff comes this is where the good stuff comes okay so we're talking about makeup <laughs> okay i decided to get the makeup forever glitter dust I got these when they were on clearance. I believe they're on clearance still right now. Okay, so if you're able to get them, snatch them up. These colors, ooh. Look how pretty these colors are. If y'all want me to do a review on these colors or you want me to do a review on anything that I'm mentioning, let me know. List it down below, let me know. Oh my God. So we there's two glitters and there's two like uh, pigments. They're not you know, that thick glitter. They're just like finely milled glitter. That was on clearance. I got the Jouer Rose Gold Powder Highlighter and Lip Cream and Lip Topper. I got this because when I saw it in the store, I swatched it and I was like, because at first I didn't think it was brown girl friendly, but <laughs> I was fooled. Um, this Jouer has a lot of lip toppers. It's like skinny dip and all. Like, so basically you'll put down a lipstick and then put that lip topper on top of it and it just brings your lipstick your, and your lips to another level like Wanda baby, yes. So, um, and also the highlighter, I was like, okay, I was pleasantly surprised. I mean, I like to shine bright like a diamond. I want you to see me from the stars, honey. And this, this highlighter will do that, just that. Okay, so I apologize, but um, I had already took it off the package. In this cute, Too Faced had a set that included, um, it's called Peaches and, Peach, Peaches and Cream Peach Tinsel. Golly, you can't say that. It is the sparkling body powder, and this is the puff that came with it. So you could just put it all over your neck and your decollete and all that. And then it also came with a lipstick. Sunday Fun Day came with this, so it's a set. Cute, huh? And then 
Let me show y'all the difference between um, that Sunday fun day and then I end up buying baby down. So this is Sunday Funny. All of uh, Too Faced's peach lipsticks, they're very creamy and they smell like peaches. I just love them. So this one is, y'all can see that. That one is Sunday Fun Day. Mm, smells so good. And then this one is Doll Face. Now Doll Face, if you're a little brown skin girl, You're gonna to have to, you know, wear a nice brown lip liner around it, mat it up, and you can wear it, okay? Don't be scared, you can do it. So, there are two different shades, and they smell so good. All of, the, all of them are very nice, they're very moisturized, and they're not drying, and they smell like heaven. I also got for lips, I got the um, Urban Decay, when they had the cherry, the cherry hole, uh, the cherry palette and all that. I ended up deciding to get one of the lipsticks and this one is called Juicy, hey, Juicy. And it looks like this. And the packaging is so cute because it's all like just cherries. But that's what the lipstick looks like. That's what the swatch looks like. Did y'all see that deal? Let me do another swatch. And it has like the glitter with it. It's like a bronzy, I don't know. It's like a bronzy, doesn't have a smell. And it has like little bitty flecks of glitter in it. It's really pretty. I got the Kat Von D Best of Nudes palette. So you get one, two, three, four, five, six different small lippies. The lippies look like this. I'm not gonna pull them all out. If you guys want me to do lip swatches of all of them, I will. They're small like this, but then it gives you an opportunity to be able to try the formula, see if you like them. I love Kat Von D's lipsticks myself. My favorite one right now in this package is Ophelia, and I love Bow and Arrow, and Piaf is like a, a nice dark brown, just so pretty. And now uh, this color is called Crucifix. Look how pretty that is. Ooh. So if you guys want me to do um, some swatches of that, I would definitely do so. And I believe that this was just on clearance as well. I'm gonna put all the prices down below. It's not too late. Y'all still gotta get stuff for Christmas. You still can do it. Next lip product I have is the Bite Beauty Lip Pencil. I needed a brown, like I told y'all, I needed, I love brown lip uh, liners. This was a nice one, but to me, this color was more like burgundy like a dark burgundy wasn't the brown that I was looking for but these were on clearance all the bite lips lip liners are on clearance right now so you are able to get you know try them I think they're nine dollars you're able to try them they're a good consistency but you can see the difference between this color and that brown molasses at the top that is not the same brown you know sometimes you just need that chocolate brown and that's what molasses is guys I don't know if y'all seen this, but this palette has been around for a while. It is the Violet Boss Like a Boss palette. And this was on clearance for $27. I wasn't even going to get it. I wasn't going to get it because I ain't need it. And there's other palettes that I figure, you know, that I had those same colors. Let me show you the colors. And yeah, I've been playing in it. So there, I have other palettes that have these colors. But when it dropped down to $27... Hello, look at this. I want y'all to see this. <laughs> this is not a new palette, but when it's $27, $27, $27, you should get it. I don't know. I don't know if it's available anymore. We ran out of it in the store. If you're able to get your hands on it, I suggest you do so. Oh. I got the Kat Von D Glitter Gel for Face and Body. This is a this is a pretty, pretty gold. If you guys need me to do a show and tell on this, this gold can be a liner. You can make it to be like um, a paste and put it on for eyeshadow. You can make it to be, uh, you know, for your shoulders, you know, glimmer for your shoulders just by putting a little dab on it and then using your brush and fluffing it in. Oh my goodness. This is a gold that I haven't, I feel like I have to show y'all now. I just feel like, feel like I have to show you. I'm so sorry. 
I want to play in it anyway. <laughs> like, yeah, you're done. And it's in a like a pot, like you know, like a like a pot. Oh, y'all, oh, y'all see it? Do you see it? See how pretty it is? I'm not even gonna dip my finger in there because there's a little on the top. I'm just gonna put my finger in this. So there's some on this top. Oh Lord, look at it. That's go. That's go. And it's like a liquid. Um, I could explain it. It's it's a liquid. It's a liquid. And it doesn't turn into, you know, a dry consistency consistency until it's blended in. But that's a liquid all day. Oh. And I I would advise you to keep the top on because I would think that it would be easily to be dried out. I have the glitter topper from Violet Voss as well. It's liquid glitter gel. And this color that I got was Galactic Gem. Looks like this. And let's see. Let's see. And they have, I think, two, three other um, colors. And it looks like that. So I will put that as a topper on my eye. Look how per Ooh. Do y'all see the hue, the change in this? Galactic gem. It's like green, blue, white. I, I don't even know. That is so pretty. And the only reason why I knew anything about it because it was a YouTuber that I was watching. Can't think of her name right now. I'll put it down below. But um, she popped that sucker on her eye and I was like, are you for real? So just imagine if you're doing a cut crease and then you pop this just like in the just the, the, the just the, the tear duct area and right here, just that front area. Ooh, gotta be pretty. Yes. I got my YSL foundation, all hours foundation. So <laughs> I was like, I have to at least get a foundation, right? My favorite foundation right now is the uh, Too Faced uh, foundation. Thank you, Jackie Aina. Chai is my color as well, darling. Mm -hmm. um, but I did want to try the YSL, and we don't have YSL foundation in our store. And so when I was in Indiana, I ended up getting a sample of this. This stuff, all hours foundation, this stuff. It's a little expensive, but I didn't care because it had my face looking like everything. And look at the bottom. Isn't it bougie? <laughs> She's so cute. So I'm going to use her when it's like those extra sleigh days, you know, because I think it was like 54 to 60 bucks. I really believe it was, you know, that's the retail price for YSL. But sometimes you got to pay to play. I'm just saying. I got my peach mist from Too Faced. It's the mattifying setting spray. This stuff is bomb. If you are oily and you need to spray your life and you want to be met. Yep. This right here, this is the BB color stick. BB color stick, right? So y'all see that I got red in my hair, right? They have red. They have they have um, blonde. They have a lot of colors. I am going to show you that. Hopefully this is catching on camera. If you need some help with, you know, getting to the salon and you haven't had a chance to dye your hair, you need to get those roots. Okay. Look, I just made myself, I just made streaks in my hair. Didn't even know it. But you see what it does? So it's it, it it just helps you in that in between time. You see, this stuff is bomb. I just wish it was a bigger <laughs> a bigger stick because I already know I'm gonna be using this stick up, and I was using it in the store like you know you know we able to use the samples and stuff like that. But I was like, y'all not gonna have no red left because I didn't rehook up my whole head. <laughs> we hooked up the whole head. I have been wanting this lady's palette because she's just bomb.com. Auntie Pat, oh, I love you. Yeah. Oh my God, just look at the package. Just look at the packaging. So, this is the Pat McGrath Mothership Sublime Bronze Temptation Eyeshadow Palette. Oh my God, that's a, that's a lot. 
Auntie Pat, can we make a small, a shorter name? But it don't matter what the name is. It matter what's inside. Look at the packaging, though. Isn't it just beautiful? Mm. Open it up. You see, she even got you like, you know, unclasp me. And then you open it up. It's nothing but beauty. I'm sorry, I don't want to blind you guys. And yes, I played in it, and I love this color. Just the colors, the hues. Let's do. Let's do. I don't want to. Look at that. It's a shift. It's a shift to that. You see it? I pray that you can see it. This color. Well, I'm not giving y'all the finger. <laughs> that green. It's not green, really. It's like aqua green. Oh my god. It matches. Oh, it matches my shade. But I love her for this. I just love her. So pretty, so pretty, so pigmented. And this was $55. So um, the big ones are what, $129 or $125 or something like that. I'll list it down below. But I was like, well, I must still collect these little ones. And then eventually one day if I see one and I'm like, oh yeah, then I'm going to go ahead and drop that money. But I was just like, I can't do it, I can't do it. So I did grab some stuff for my hair because y'all know that I am... Um, you know, I'm redhead, I'm natural girl, I'm a curly girl, and I wanted to see what hair products were out there. Um, I saw some things that were on clearance for Madam CJ Walker. I decided to get the, uh, excuse me, the Frizz Fighting Coconut and mar mar Marugana Oil Curl Whip Styling Souffle. That's, that's a lot. <laughs> And it's for volumizing and defining. So I think that what it'll do is it'll, it'll help fight my frizz and it'll define my curls. That's all I care about. So yeah, I'm gonna probably use this with my next tutorial and show you guys how I uh, make my hair curly. So um, I wanted to get some of the other CJ, uh, uh, Madam CJ Walker's products, but since they were on clearance, everybody was nabbing them and they're all sold out. So, cause I wanted to get the mask, I wanted to get the shampoo, I wanted to get the conditioner, or even the co-wash. I was just trying to get something to at least wash my hair and then I can do this and then I can say, as a set, it works. But I really don't know because it was sold out. So yeah, got that. I let y'all know that I'm a curly girl and um, my hair is flat ironed right now. I usually don't flat iron my hair. Uh, I usually go to the shop, blow dry, flat iron, sit a while, pay the people, all that good stuff. And I said, you know, to myself, I said, self, let's try to do this on your own. You can flat iron your own hair. You can blow dry your own hair. You used to do it a long time ago. You still can do it. When I seen this product right here, it made me want to blow dry my hair. Don't look at the price, y'all. But just look at the beauty. Just look at the beauty, okay? <laughs> Ain't it beautiful? <laughs> I'm a sucker for packaging. Like, show me anything and I'm like, ooh, packaging, yeah. And then the product could be sucky in the in the middle and you're like, but I could just put it on my vanity. <laughs> you give me with packaging, you got my coins. But with this product, I actually used it and it dried my hair so fast, so fast. So dry bar got something going on. I didn't use the brush. I didn't use anything but the dryer, okay? So I already know that the, these dryers from uh, Dry Bar are very expensive, so I knew that already, but then I was getting all this other stuff to go with it. So you get the brush, you get a glitter sp uh, spray, which is a spritzer spray, which, I, you know, for the holiday, maybe I might want to put some glitter in my hair. I don't know. Um, you have a texturizing spray and a detox dry shampoo spray. Two glitter ties, which I probably will use, in, but um, what I did was I used this blow dryer and I used my paddle brush, and it got my hair super straight. Um, it wasn't wavy. I've had this hair up now for um, almost about a week now, and I usually, if I dance or anything like that, my hair just go poof, you know, and it didn't even do that, just barely, and that's just like really right here. Um, I am very 
proud of myself. Sometimes it just takes the right products, you know, and that's just less money that I have to spend, um, you know, at the salon, less time that I have to be away at the salon. Now, if you just want a pamper day, great, but if you can do it yourself, do it yourself. I love candles, and every now and then you have to splurge on yourself, get in the tub, you know, have you some bubble bath running, have you a glass of wine, and have a candle lit. This is the Nest candle. So they always have candles throughout the year, but they really kind of promote the candles for the holidays. This is the Sparkling Cassis. And this smells, it smells so good. They have the one that, you know, smells like pine, kind of like woodsy or something like that. They had one that I really love called apricot tea. But this um, this sparkling cassis is very nice. It is a little more pricier. I believe this is $16. Now compared to my Bath and Body Works, you know, which is huge like this, but I consider this a luxury item. And so I buy me one, you know, for the holiday and that's it. Now the Bath and Body Works, I buy those throughout the year. But this, this is like my special thing. So check them out. What, what things on my shopping spree did you already buy? Or what things on my shopping spree are you going to buy? You have enough time to still go to the mall and get it in. And every week they still do more clearances, more sales. Don't forget to check your emails because guess what? They are sending these specials to you in your emails. I have so many clients that come in and they're like, oh, I didn't even know I had that coupon. Yes, you have a coupon. Yes, we have sales. Come on in, spend that money. Yeah, 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 out the door. <laughs> oh my goodness, so I hope I didn't bore you guys too much. I My, my, my haul was out of control, but you know, I had to do what I had to do. You know, see, I bought some stuff. Most of it was for me. You know, I bought a few items for my husband. But, you know, I deserve some things, too. <laughs> oh, did you guys like this video? I hope you did. I like doing hauls. I don't want it to be like I'm showing off or anything like that. I think it's educational. If you want me to um, demonstrate or review any of the products that I bought and I've showed you here today, let me know. I am doing a giveaway. How about that? I want to say thank you for all the people that have watched my channel, our clients, makeup clients of mine, people that have just gave me encouragement, Instagram. I'm doing a thank you giveaway at the end of the month, and I just want to say thank you so much. Please don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. I'll talk to y'all later. Bye-bye. These are the good times with you, baby.